John, this is our first kiss ever on the show. Is that right? Yes. Okay, well, ode to Mr. Gene Simmons right here. All right, sir, what we got going on today? So we're going to react to a very legendary band, Kiss. If you've never heard of Kiss, look them up. Kiss. Uh, yeah, so this is one of their, uh, th- this is one of the songs that were written before the original band members got replaced. And this right. actually is a live uh, rendition um, where they were playing in Australia with symphony orchestra i'm so curious yeah so uh it's gonna maybe a trigger warning (laughs) there's a lot of theatrics involved when it comes to kiss Kiss. so keep an open mind god of thunder right set that up well i'm 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 ready all right i'm ready to get weird What year was this? The mid to 2000s. All right, gotcha. You know, he was named, he was known as the demon in the band. Yep, yep. That's Australia. Yeah. Ready to rock. Look crazy for Kiss. What a showman, right? It's all about the show. Effects were pretty cool. Yeah. They basically took a three minute song, made it six minutes. Let's go, Gene. Let's go, man. Is he going to fly? There he goes. Eventually, they'll play the song. (laughs) Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! (laughs) Well, all right. Mm-hmm. That's cool. You see the uh, conductor with yeah. the makeup on? That's really awesome. Matter of fact, they all have makeup on.
cool sound, everyone together. Yeah. Look at that. Now, you know, when we were here last time, I never, ever, ever thought we were going to come back. But you make it hard to stay away. This army, Australia chapter, representing. Boy, repped. They officially repped. Respect. Yep. Respect. So. How does that version compare to the original for you when you hear the symphony just going all out? Oh, yeah. There, it, it. <laughs> if you like what we're doing here, we'd appreciate a like and subscribe. It helps grow the channel. You know how that goes. And it gives us opportunities to provide more of this type of content to you. It provides so much more depth. If you listen to the studio version, they have a lot of echoing and reverb and things like that to kind of build it out. But this is definitely one that you want to see live. Definitely. And I saw them actually in Dallas a long time ago. And it's the same set. Kiss really? has... The won, same set? Yeah. Kiss has won fans over the worldwide by having the same set for each tour season. And mm. uh, it's, it's just amazing. They're, they're not phenomenal musicians, but they're phenomenal showmans or showmen in showmanship you know they're just they're, they're they just put on a great show and look at the audience really think, getting into it yeah i think with kiss everyone gets they're not the best musicians in the world right but i don't really think that matters because they kind of invented this rock showmanship type of vibe where it's not cheesy but it's their own identity oh yeah and absolutely. they do it perfectly not that i mean the songs are great yeah. But no one can kind of put together a show like that. That's so versatile because you're going for the music, but you're going for them. The fun of it all, it's a unique experience unlike any other. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and they, they've done real well since 1973. Wow. When they first released their first album. So they've been going strong 50 years. You know what my first Kiss album was? Mm -mm. It was uh, Dynasty. 
Oh, really? 78? Oh, wow. It was the uh, the Disco Kiss album. Yeah, when I was 10 years old, I was in the States visiting, and I saw a commercial for them playing okay. in Anaheim. And this oh. is when I was listening to my dad's Elvis records and stuff like that. Yeah. And I remember being 10 years old and looking at the TV. I was like, what is that? I, I was, I was I the same way. I want to see that. <laughs> I don't want to... I don't want to not, uh, not only wanted to see it, but I was Paul Stanley for Halloween. Yeah. And I had uh, the action figures. Mm-hmm. And starting with Dynasty, which was probably, you know, I was a kid, so it was probably pretty soft kiss. Yeah. Right? I was made for loving you. Yeah. Kind of stuff. But it, it got me into the band then when I was a kid. And it was, it was a really fun experience considering it was the 70s. Yeah, oh, yeah. It was quintessential 70s awesomeness with the billboard, and they probably invented the, the marketing of themselves and all that. Oh, for sure. They're like at the forefront of all that, which is just amazing. You know, it's it's very American. Well, they're very self-promoting. <laughs> for band. sure. Gene Simmons is the biggest reason behind that. Yeah. Could you imagine those seven-inch platform heels? Gene Simmons is already tall, and being over six foot. So being about seven foot larger than life in, in the outfits and Paul Stanley, Ace Fraley, Peter Chris, and I can't remember who the newer members yeah. are, but that's just like a very intimidating impact. It's it's this force, you know? I, and like you, every Halloween I dressed up as Gene Simmons. I did the ketchup packets. Oh. I made my own ketchup packets. I put in the back okay. and I would crunch on them and I'd have the blood run down. Wow, you were into it, man. Oh yeah, I and was I, just I was just doing the Star Child thing. Oh no, I had the hair and everything, but, but I was a whole foot short. I'm still a whole foot shorter than Gene Simmons, <laughs> larger than life. Look. But they were able to get through it through their alter egos, whether it's Demon, Star Child, Cat Man, or Space Man. Help them uh, cope. Sure. With the success and all the touring and everything, it's not a bad idea. Who is Kiss? Yeah. You know, are they a demonic group? I mean, who are they? Murph Griffin. They were on the Murph Griffin show, and Gene Simmons was on it, and he just made everybody feel uncomfortable. Everybody. It was awesome. <laughs> I would say like ahead of their time. Yeah. That's not stupid to say, right? No. It's more than just the music. Well, yeah, and they created the Kiss Army. Which is a, a, a the- social media storm just 30 years prior to Yeah, it was all before social, social media. media. It was before all of it. And they, they had the did. Kiss Army newsletter. They had chapters all throughout the world. And they created a loyal following. And they did it first. Yeah. Kiss was so far ahead of its time. You have to give them credit for that. Absolutely. And they have they have some they have some awesome songs. People give them grief. I don't care. They have some really amazing songs, like them or not. Oh, true. Oh, I'm I'm a Kiss fan through and through. Even in their disco days. And I'm an electronic guy. <laughs> yeah. I'm all about electronic music. And even I am not oblivious to uh, some of the greatness that Kiss has done. It's this, It's worldwide. It's revolutionary. But I think Kiss can only exist in America. Kiss comic book. The Kiss movie. They put a lot putting of television the, appearances, putting the, their own blood. Yeah, mixing the, the own blood in the ink yeah. for that Kiss comic book, uh-huh. um, and touring every country in the world. I don't think there's a country they have not toured. And Kiss is America, like it or not. That is kind of the Kiss is the America, all hairy, in your face, only loud and proud. Only America could produce Kiss. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> all right, that was that was fabulous. God of Thunder, Kiss, God of Thunder. Symphony Alive. That version, um, I didn't know what to expect, but that really worked. The fact that the the members in the symphony and conductor all had makeup on, that was such a cool vibe. I'm, I'm glad. Thank you for showing me that. Yeah, not at all. And hopefully, the audience, if you're based in Australia, you can comment on it. Let us know what you think. Were you there? Absolutely. Were you there? Love to hear a story if you were there. All right, thank you so much for watching the show today. Kiss for the first time on the channel. There you go. Yay. Yay. Kiss out. (laughs) Kiss out, baby. All right, thank you. Bye. Bye.